Right, so in this question, we're given two shapes here, quadrilateral triangle, and it says that the perimeter of the quadrilateral is equal to the perimeter of the triangle. They're equal, right? So that's key to this in terms of writing down an equation. So let's start off with the quadrilateral, okay? So put Q for quadrilateral. The perimeter, okay, will equal to... Remember now, perimeter is the distance all the way around. So I mean, we could start up here and then work my way around. So I've got x plus 7. Add then that x. Add the x plus 6. Add the 3x minus 5. So you just literally add the dis distances together. And that comes to, well, we can simplify this, x add x add x add 3x. So all the x's are positive. So x add x add x is 3x. Add 3x is 6x. And then the numbers then 7, add 6 is 13, take away 5 is plus 8, okay? So the perimeter of the quadrilateral is 6x plus 8. The triangle, the perimeter, well, there's three sides here, of course. So you, if you start at the top, maybe you've got x plus 5 plus 2x minus 1 plus x plus 8. So that will total, well, x plus 2x plus x is 4x. And then 5, take away 1 is 4, add 8 is 12. Okay. So we've got the perimeter simplified, and they say they're equal, aren't they? So when it says write down an equation, all I've got to say now is, well, look, 6x plus 8 is equal to 4x plus 12. And I finished off part A there. We've written down an equation. Perimeters are equal, so we get that. But simply all of that added will equal to all of that added. All I've got to do here is solve the equation. So we've got x's on both sides. So what you do is get the x's onto one side. So take that 4x over, it becomes a minus 4x. You've got 12 here, take that 8 over, it becomes a minus 8. So this becomes 2x, and 12 take away 8 is um, 4. So then to get x, you've got to do 4, then take the 2 over and divide. 4 divided by 2 is equal to 2. So we've got a final answer then of 2.